one owner car guy, oneownercarguy.com. And this here is going to be a video about box trailers, semi trailers. Mom and dad got a fifth wheel. They came up here to Montana. We've been hanging out, going to auctions, doing stuff like that. Now, usually a box trailer that you get, a semi trailer, looks like this. Yuck! All banged up. Usually got a bunch of graffiti on it and stuff, too. These are nothing like that. These are beautiful. You'll see them in a second. Got this Lariat stinking um, Ford F350 in? 250, excuse me. 350. Oh, there's a quail. Doing, 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 doing. They're all over out here. Let's see what else we can find, huh? Look, there they are. Oops. I feel all bad when I scare them. There's one on the fence still. There he goes. Or she. Okay, got the F350 Power Stroke. Good, good truck, good truck. Got the diesel blazer. Man, we got all kinds of stuff out here. Give me a call if you're interested in anything. Check out this video. These are my Valvoline semi-trailers. They're in great shape. And if you want them, get a hold of me, Nathan, 406-546-8748. I should put these on my website also, One Owner Car Guy. Subscribe down below. Click the little bell button for the notifications and such. Enjoy the video. One Owner Car Guy, oneownercarguy.com. And I'm moving. And I've got cars everywhere here. They're just sitting everywhere. Look at them. You can see them. They're sitting everywhere, literally. But I have two of these beautiful Valvoline trailers. And I'm going to go show you both of them. Um, they're 40-something feet. And I will put that in the ad. And I'll let you know what they are. Uh, I Maybe mean, I should have started from the middle on this. I don't know. I've got two of them. They're absolutely gorgeous. They're not all graffitied up. There's, when I say there's not a mark on them, there's not a mark on them as far as graffiti or nothing. You got little, little mark there and there. Stuff like that. There is a little ding up there I can see. But um, overall, the ding there. Got the little things like this on. Look there. Maintenance operating manual. And this was Valvoline. Um, I don't know what that one is. Oh, registration. Permanent trailer registration. Isn't that cool? And then you got your electrical and your air and all that stuff. Uh, hitch and everything's good. This thing is real metal. It's not rusty. You might have a little patina where it's got the thingy thing knocked off of it. Reflectors are getting a little old, I'm sure. But Xerox, Pyrol, Eagle One. Man, I look like I'm sponsored by Dale Earnhardt or Rusty Wallace out here. Okay, these things are freaking bad to the bone. And not only that, they are... Well, I'll show you on the other one. I'll bet you the lighting would be better. And whether you like the up and down stripes or the non-up and down. Now, they've sat for a while. So, you know, going. they've got different kind of wheels on them, too. But they've got great tires, except they're going to be older. Uh, no dry rot. Uh, let's go down and look at this one. These are awesome tires. I mean, tires. Trailers. And I got Bimmers, I got Chargers, I got all kinds of Mercedes and all kinds of cars out here. Everything's for sale. And um, it gets dusty really quick. The forklift ain't for sale. This one has the look with the rivets. Um, very nice truck. Different setup for it. Oh, well, maybe they're just sitting at a different angle. I'll bet they are. This is number three. And that's number T1555. One five, oh, number eight. That's number eight. Three and eight, buddy. Um, what year are these? I forgot. I did forget. This one I don't think has. That. But they have just sat here for yours and yours. About eight of them, to be exact. And now it's time for me to move everything out. Yeah, there's a couple things on that one where it's been up there. God, dude, what did you do to your truck when you did that? I'll tell you that much. Okay, I've got a low battery here, but I've got more battery in my truck. And, um, geez, I don't know. With all the tires and garbage under this thing, um, it has a couple scuffs on it there. Got a little paint coming off right here. But I'm here to tell you it's clean. Um, and the vinyl is still stuck on real good. 
This one's faded a bit. I'd probably redo the vinyl. Just because I think it's so cool. This one, the reflectors are a bit better. There's your little thing to knock your door open. Mud flappers. Oh no. And I've got a lock on it. So I'm going to clip something in here in a second. I had to come back and get the key anyways. So I figured I'd show you in this one. They're super clean on the inside. They're wood lined. As you can see. And three sets of rollers, buddy. These guys were rolling pallets of um, oil to the front. And you can stick two pallets in here and you can just literally put your hand on them and walk them down. It's so nice. I'm going to leave this open. And I'm going to show you in the other one. Um, so many cars. Beautiful 500 SEC. But these van box trailers, whatever you want to call them, semi trailers. I guess you should call them what they are. They're a semi trailer. Delonte CL500. Woo! Grandpa Car Buick. <laughs> well, that was it. Hope you enjoyed. They're cool. They're clean. And then rollers inside? Man, you can roll stuff right to the front of them things with just a push of the hand. That's the deal. Nathan, 406-546-8748. Give me a call. Let's do this.